So for today's video, I'm going to show you an area that has never been seen before in Buddy Scholarship Edition. Now to access this area, you will need two mods. You will need the boss's no clip mod, and you will also need Deadpool XYZ's teleport mod. Once you've installed them both, um, you have to install the no clip mod first, and then install the teleport mod. Teleport to the auto shop, as you see on screen here. Now once you teleport, press down on the D-pad twice, press RT to go up, and you'll see an exact clone of the auto shop. Fly over there, and then press double tap, um, double tap the D-pad to end the um, flying effect. And you'll see this area, Bullworth Annual School Sale, with all these weird props. Like as you can see, we've got the uh, Future Street Racer Arcade. We've got loads of props that... Um, I think Jimmy Jimmy actually gets throughout the game actually like the skateboard there's a letterbox the gnomes that Jimmy has to smash um, his ju Christmas jumper as a present from his mom the uh, skeleton the mascot head bike helmet um, oh yeah sorry about this I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna do this a couple times in the video because when you press the left thumb stick down it resets you back to that interior now as I was saying um you know there's like I think that's a dodgeball no that's a frisbee I think hang on yeah that's a frisbee Sorry, from this angle, it looks like it was a uh, dodgeball. You know, like, you know, there's um, an American football. A uh, soccer ball, as you Americans call it. One of the carnival hats Jimmy can buy. A Grotto and Gremlins character card, I believe. A bike. Now, what's interesting about this interior is even though it's never used at all, it uses the exact same collision as the uh, default auto shop, as you'll see in a minute. Like, Jimmy can walk through all these. Oh yeah, the props there are like CDs, a spud gun, and I presume that's a chem kit. And I teleported away again then. But yeah, as I was saying, like, you know, like, th this room actually uses the exact same collision as the default auto shop. I'm just wondering what it's actually used for, like, Bullworth annual school sale with all these things there. Does that mean Jimmy originally had to buy his, um, Christmas jumper? Or what? Hmm, it's very interesting. I'm, I'm gonna say that for nothing. And also, uh, it's worth noting as well that the uh, beam machine, um, beam machine, the beam cola machine actually works perfectly in here. And there's no door either, which is weird. Like, uh, if you stand far away back, you can actually see the other auto shop interior. So, like, I wonder if this room was actually cut late or early into Bully's development. Now, uh, this next bit's sort of interesting, because while you're here, Jimmy actually appears on the world map, but miles and miles away from Bullworth or the Academy itself, really. I just find this bit just very slightly interesting, because it shows where Bully positions its interiors, because in the Grand Theft Auto games, especially San Andreas, like, um, not for all interiors, but like, um, for example, CJ's house, Sweet's house, Ryder's house, they'd all be positioned way above the actual interior itself. Generic interiors would be positioned in random places, if I remember correctly. But you know, I just find it interesting that Bully positions its interiors miles away from the actual map itself. Because the future Street Racer arcade game actually takes place just on the outskirts of Bullworth. Anyway, that's all for this video and thank you for watching.